Hello and welcome to this video. Today we're looking at Sway. It's a cloud-based presentation piece of software from Microsoft. Uh, it's probably my favorite piece of Microsoft software for a long, long time. I think the established ones are almost too big now. Um, and this has a very nice look and, look and feel to it. So we're gonna dive in and have a look at it. So the first thing you come in, you can come in, uh, you've got the ability to import a Word, a PowerPoint, or a PDF, or you can create new. Down the bottom, we've got a number of templates that you can click on and, and edit. And then at the bottom, we've got some examples of how it's been used in the past. So first off, let's go and create a new one, and then I'll show you one that I've created already. So we click on the Create New. And then down the left hand side, we've got the elements that we can we can drop in. So we could enter in our title in here. And then after we've entered in our title, we may decide to add a background image. And it provides you with lots of suggested content based on your topic, which is quite nice. So you can search for sources. There are a range of sources. You've got Flickr, Bing, Picket, YouTube, Twitter, or you can upload images of your own. So we'll, we'll search for, for some content. Uh, and then we can bring some content in. So we'll decide that I want that image. And we just drag and drop the image into place. And then we can click to add more content. So we could decide we want to add some text now. So I could put in some stuff about my great uncle Cyril. Um, and then I may decide that I want to add some more content. So we could decide to add an image. Or we could go back and we could decide actually we're after a video. So we could go to YouTube. And again, it would bring up some videos and we could find a video we like the look of uh, and just drag and drop. So it's really nice, easy interface to use and we can keep carrying on as we go. And then when we're ready, we're happy with that. We may decide we want to add a, 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 something to do with some media from Twitter or, or videos or images and we can keep on adding. And when we're happy, we can just preview the design. So we click preview. Uh, and that's what we've got. So we've got the title at the top, we've got the image in there, we've got the video. So that's one. And then if you want a different style, you can click on remix and it will apply a different format to it. So we can now see it's going this way. And we can hit remix again and it should, and it will keep cycling through different formats, whether they're formats that go up and down or formats that go left to right. So that is how we use it. And then when we're finished with it, we click share and we can choose to share it either with the embed code or we can ask it's available to anyone with the link. So we've got different share options. Um, one which is available to the public, uh, one that's only available to my organization. And I can obviously share that directly to social media. If I want to work collaboratively on a platform, then I just go to authors and I send them that link and then they can also edit. So we're just gonna jump back to the start and I'll show you one that I've made earlier. So I'll preview that. So you can see really nice look and feel to it. Uh, I've got a picture at the top with the headline it then combines the pictures and it's doing all of this resizing for you. And just a really nice look and feel. And as I say, if I use the remix function, it, it presents it in a slightly different format. And I can keep just remixing it until I've got a, to a, a layout that I'm happy with. Or I can click on layout and I can choose 
a different way. So if I want to go portrait, so we've got up and down portrait, and left to right again in a more traditional portrait style, uh, presentation style. So there you have it, Sway, my favorite Microsoft product so far. Thanks for watching, join me again soon.